people, it's Courtney, and today I'm here with Andy again. Hey, everybody. <laughs> today, he's doing me a very big favor today. If you guys follow me on social media, you know I've had the flu all week, but I wanted to get one more video up before Christmas, and I've had this video idea for a while now that I thought it'd be kind of fun. So I thought, what better than to put some of my recent weird DIYs in front of them, let them guess what it is, let them play with it, let them make fun of me for wasting my time on these things. We're just gonna see how this goes. I had like this idea and I was like, let's try it and maybe you guys like it. So just like hopefully this guy is about to entertain you, uh, this video is sponsored by Full Screen. so if you need some a little extra entertainment, you can click the link down below and it is a video subscription service and you get a one week free trial with the link and then also it's only $5.99 a month after that. They have tons of popular TV shows and movies that you can go and binge watch on there. They have the Titanic, they have Glee, they have The Hills, which I am finally getting to watch. And they also have their own original shows on there as well, which I think is great. You could go watch some of your favorite YouTubers. So if you do want to check them out, I'll leave a link down below. Go get your free week trial and let's get started guessing these DIYs. Let's do it. Are you ready? Um, kind of. So, what is that? Do you know what it is before you open it? Yeah, it should be like chapstick. So you think it's chapstick, but I made a DIY out of it. Oh. Did you break it? <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, I think it was supposed to be a snow globe. Yeah. Was it? How do you know? Because you can see the little things in there, like it was like a snow snowman or something. It was, I mean, rest in peace, dude. Don't try this DIY. I, I have no idea what that is. Literally looks like ice. What? Like the? ice? You could take it out of the bag. It what like, does it look like to you? It looks like ice. Ice? That's a, like a good guess. Like, like a little puddle of ice. What is this? It feels like, it feels like it breast implants or something. <laughs> this thing. I mean, come on, look at that. What does it look like ice? It's very slippery too. What do you think it's made out of? Oh. It's I'm, only two things. It's gotta be glue. Yeah. Because I know you, you bought like 15 gallons of glue in the last week. It's not that cream of tartar stuff, is it? No. Tartar. You're tartar. just thinking of all the things I bought. Yeah. Hairspray? I don't know. No. It's made out of like borax. You know that what? laundry what, stuff? glue and borax makes uh -huh. this? Really? Yeah. It's supposed to be like slime. So that is actually liquid glass, it's supposed to be. Pretty cool. I think liquid ice, though, is a good guess. What was all that used for? Explain what it is. It's gum wrapper. And what was it used for? Yeah. Why did I need so much gum? Um, Play-Doh. You make Play-Doh out of gum? I don't know, you probably could somehow. Like, what did I do? It doesn't have to be a DIY. Just what did I do with a hundred pieces of gum? A hundred pieces of gum? You made some sort of bonding agent and fixed like a broken piece of ceramic or something? I have no idea. <laughs> no. Best guess. That was my last, my last best guess. I stuck as many pieces of gum as I could in my mouth at one time. Well, that's not a DIY. How many did you get in there? Not very many. You suck. Like 30. Really? <laughs> So we have this big, uh, this has got to be like, this literally smells like Play-Doh. Does it? Yeah, it smells like Play-Doh. Is this supposed to be like your interpretation of phloem? No, no, this is Play-Doh. Yeah. This is supposed to be your, your Play-Doh. Yeah, it's definitely squishy. It's like a week old. Yeah, I bet like when it was first made, it was really good. But like right now it's kind of like starting to powder off a little bit. It's also been like really cold here, so this thing is freezing. So what do you think that was made out of? This was made out of that cream of tartar. Yeah, but like, what do you and think? Glue. No glue. No glue. Bubble gum? <laughs> Bubble gum. Really? Yeah. The ones that you chewed? Yeah, I put it in there. So you chewed the gum and then you put it in here with the cream of tartar. To make Play Doh. And this was in your mouth? Yeah. I'm just kidding. Hairspray, uh, lotion. Uh, Why do you think hairspray goes in all these DIYs? I don't know. DIYs? I, I feel like you use hairspray for a lot of DIYs. I don't think I've used it for any DIYs. You used crayons for this. Yeah. How did you manage that? That gives it the color. You melted it? Uh huh. How'd you do that? With a lighter? What? No. In the stove? On the stove? Hold it up if you can. 
is heavy. I know. It looks like grandma's tapioca pudding or like coleslaw or something like that. And it is filled to the brim. And I was looking for this bowl a couple days ago. Oh, this has got to be the flum for sure. It's got all these little beads and balls. And... P.S. Flum doesn't stay good for a very long time. Was it good when you first made it? Yeah. Didn't you see the video? Yeah, it's like it's rejecting all the foam balls. <laughs> you make this up. It's like fart putty. Do you, do you have like a little canister or something? Hey, Courtney will be back next week. I know I'm not that funny, but hey, it is what it is. And maybe she'll clean up this mess in here that she made. <laughs>